Welcome to Chris Swift Studio. This is Chris, and in today's tutorial, we're going to be going over a quick way to hack color adjustments. Color can tell a story, and it can tell a story just as well as uh, the other means you have for storytelling. Dialogue, setting, uh, music, body language, all of these things can tell a story. Now, let's say you have a particular clip of, for example, a couple at a restaurant, and they're having a conversation, and over the course of about a minute or so, it turns from a warm and friendly conversation into a fight. Well, which is my basic experience at a Thanksgiving dinner with the relatives. So, to tell the story with color, what you might do is have a you know nice warmish kind of yellow in the beginning, and then it slightly changes to a cold bluish when the fight begins. So, there's no real way to keyframe with color adjustments. You can't animate color adjustments in Final Cut Pro, as you can animate other things like transform. It's easy to set keyframes and distort, and even in audio, it's easy to animate audio. So here's one way to hack this situation. One thing I do is, let's say, now this has obviously nothing to do with the conversation, but just for demo purposes only, what I want to do is change the color from here to here in this transition. I would use the keyboard shortcut B to get the blade tool, blade it right there, and go back to the select tool with the keyboard shortcut A, and then I would decide what color I want actually on the second half here and change that. Now I'll go ahead and make something real radical here. Let's make a real radical contrast change. And also, why don't I just bring in a really garish, screaming kind of uh, blazing sun yellow. Okay, got that done. Now to make my transition, what I'm going to do is open the transition browser, cross dissolve, drop that right in the middle, and now I've got my transition from one color to another. Now I might want to make this a lot longer to lengthen the duration and bring it gradually, slowly bring it in. In that case, what you can do is right click and keyboard shortcut control D to change the duration. You'll light up here. Now just simply type in numbers. You don't have to type in the colons or the semicolons, just simply type in numbers. And let's say I want this to transition for four seconds. Four zero zero enter. And there we go. Now I have a real smooth one. Okay, I hope this has been some kind of help for you in how to possibly quote unquote hack a keyframe for color adjustments and also change the duration of a transition. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time. Let it rain, let it pour, let it rain a whole lot more cause I got them deep river blues. Let that old river rise and fall. Let the big waves make a wall cause I got them deep river